2009. Now, what can we say? Well, Tamana turned out in New South Wales colours before heading back to rugby league and the guru showed he's got the musical ability to match that of his footy heydays. An old pirate stopped by with quite the gift of the gab. When your team is getting hammered and there's nothing left to give and there's a feeling in your heart that you'd rather die than live. Some seriously crazy people jumped off Mount Bora in all sorts of flying machines. An old shark took to the skies too. He was just one of a number of footy faces that came, saw and conquered the northwest. Don't trust that feeling like The local league stars weren't without their moments in the sun. Jamie was back in the origin fold while Tungy was on the cast and Tom Leroy Lars bashed his way into a New South Wales origin jumper. Oh, Leroy Lars and the Carmichael Hunt came together. Closer to home, the season started with tragedy for the Dungowan Cowboys. They lost good mate Steve Gusto Mamey. In his honour, they came from behind and took back-to-back -to -back premierships. The West Lions smashed the Bears' stranglehold on the Group 4 competition, a little bloke called Matty Neen causing havoc in the grand final. The Pirates finally cracked it in the rugby. Close for three years, 2009 was their crowning glory. The Swans were flying high in the AFL. They sent the Saints crashing back to earth to win the local flag. Yeah! While we've got the Sharon in hand, the big man Spider stopped in to say good day. Albies were up to their old tricks when they knocked the Blues off in the New England Rugby Grand Final. The influx of rugby superstars to the city of all seasons must have had the intended effect after all. Berkey was up for a hit of charity golf in Moray as well. His attire just a little more sensible than that of his mates. A couple of cricket legends joined him on the greens. Meanwhile, the Bendemeer Beanpole started taking wickets for his state. Thank you very much. Josh Hazelwood picked up his first wicket in Ford Ranger Cup. The Tamworth Sports Star of the Year, Aaron Osborne, also had one to remember. An Australian debut and a couple of World Cup wickets. He played right over the top of it. And Aaron Osborne, welcome to World Cup cricket. Over to two wheels, an Inverell speed demon cyclist, Heinrich Hausler, had a nasty spill in the Tour de France. He made up for it just days later when he was first across the line in the 13th stage. And he's overcome here with emotion. It was a year where Casey Stoner got sick, then Casey Stoner got slick. Casey Stoner wins here in Malay for Ducati. Others were aiming high too. And while there were some moments we'd love to forget, 2009 certainly was a year of sporting excellence. Tim Martin, Prime News.